Well, here we are back at Looking Glass in the month of May. Got some great things coming up. Had April showers this year for the April for the May flowers. Anyway, as they say. But we got a great garden now back for you to come and see with the wildflowers coming up. Have you seen some of the stuff growing on the side over there? Have you been out there looking around yet? I haven't gone out yet. Oh, I gotta get you out there then. It just leaves me in the kitchen. <laughs> <laughs> Well, uh, thank you again, guys, for supporting us this past month of April. Um, looking forward to you guys coming in in the month of May, celebrating Mother's Day with us at our yearly Mother's Day brunch that we'll be having on the 10th of May. And then, of course, uh, our dinner theater that we're having in July, I believe, is the next one in July. Uh, I'll have to double check our schedule. But either way, thank you for coming to the one that uh, we had here in April. It was a great success. Sold out crowd, awesome. Thank you very much for uh, joining us. And uh, Tom, what you got over there? Uh, I on salad, so uh, that's on well, diet. It's, you know, springtime, when people were talking about getting back to their bikinis and the guys in their swimsuits and stuff. So we're doing some healthy food. We got a nice uh, spinach artichoke dip, and it's freshly made when we, when we order it. And Paul's got the, his favorite, the pastries. Mm -hmm. So, you know, he's got a great figure. Girls love them all the time anyway, so. It's a curse. <laughs> But we have our marinated tomatoes here. It's with a uh, hussy sauce on it. It's a very old recipe from Mrs. Ainton's cookbook. And we have our, uh, of course, our cucumber salad with our secret dressing, our potato salad, and rotini salad on top of our bed of mixed greens. It's very, very healthy, very friendly, and full of phytonutrients. This is very healthy, too. Just letting you know that our Michaela has done great with our cakes. I'm kind of tall, right? <laughs> <laughs> We also have a great, you saw in the shots here, the uh, whole cakes that she put out here. That was really, really a cool cake that we put together for us. And we had it out here. So if you need especially cakes for like graduations, great wedding showers, baby showers, uh, new births to the family, call us up, we'll make a cake for you. Kayla will sit down with you and with her team, we'll make a beautiful piece of art for your festivities. So, mm -hmm. you still much know I'm it. Still okay. much <laughs> I, I, we have so many people that compliment. Paul on his eating ability. He said, yeah, hey, I blame Michaela. <laughs> I blame Michaela for the pastries today, so it is what it is. You know how that goes. I have people say, I saw Paul eating. He enjoyed it so much, I had to come and try it out. And they said, well, you never eat anything because you're going to talk about somebody's got it. But anyway, it's great. We make great iced coffees for the summertime coming out, so it's hot. You come out and enjoy those in the nice, cool Zen garden. We got the koi pond out there. Our fish are gorgeous. Can't eat them, sorry. And then we also have our I don't think anybody else in town is doing one of these. It is called a pimento grilled cheese sandwich. And we make our own pimento cheese blend in the back. Uh, we make it fresh like always. And uh, we're really a scratch kitchen. We make everything from scratch. Um, the sauces, you know, the, heck, the steaks are hand cut. The marinades we make on our steaks are good. The features we make, they're all from scratch. Fresh products. People see me in Kroger's, they see me in Sam's, whatever. And Mr. Martin's up the hill up there. I'm always getting fresh product because we're making fresh new items and getting the best products we can in the restaurant for our awesome guests. Paul won't let us do anything less than that. He's very strict on his quality control on that. So, and also our morning chefs as well doing the eggs. So you got anything to say yet? <laughs> One more wrong. Daniel. Now we just have fun here, and uh, we asked a customer to come in. Said, "Do you have some great wines?" I said, "We do, but you haven't got a Gewürztraminer." A Gewürztraminer is a European style of sweet wine. It's really great if you've been overseas. It's really a nice, sweet, relaxing wine to relax out in the garden with. Su Yen is from Francis Coppola. His daughter designed this bottle, and also not the design of the bottle, but designed the wine inside the bottle. And she's got her twist on uh, Riesling. And a lot of women come out here and really enjoy the Riesling from Su Yen. It's a good table wine with your meal or a nice sipping wine afterwards. So it's either way, both of them are great things depending on what you enjoy. We also have some great red wines as well. We've got the carnivore and uh, some other great red wines as well. So come on, check them out. And again, guys, don't forget, um, month of May is graduation uh, month for a lot of our college and high school um, sons and daughters, uh, such as mine. I've got one graduating in high school and college. So again, uh, make us, uh, your venue to come and get a dinner for them and celebrating the graduation. So again, please give us a call. Make your reservations for these parties. We'll make a nice menu for you, for them. Uh, again, thank you for supporting us. Just want to let you know. Salute, Tom. Thank you for doing all the talking. I did all the eating again. You know, but I blame Michaela this time because I have some really good stuff to eat. Right next to Ace's furniture store. Come out and see us. Thank you.